Good morning guys, uh, it's been a while since I recorded something, uh, I've been pretty busy the last couple of months, <laughs> uh, so uh, we are back on the saddle again, and uh, I think uh, the last time I spoke was I was planning to go for a trip uh, uh, to uh, the hill country, but uh, you know, unfortunately I couldn't make it because I had some other stuff coming in. So, uh, so I had to uh, cancel the trip in the last moment. <laughs> but uh, other than that, uh, yeah, you know, things have been uh, pretty good. Uh, the bike is doing uh, all right. I think uh, I've hit the uh, second uh, service mark uh, for the valve checks, I think. So that's where I am with this one. That's about 12,000 miles. Uh, the motor's GPS front is doing all right. Uh, not much of wear at about 1,000 miles. and. Uh, the rear is still hanging on at about uh, uh, probably 6,000 miles, uh, so that's pretty decent. Uh, so today I'm just heading out uh, for a, a group ride with uh, some of the uh, Indian motorcycle rider friends. So we will uh, just do some regular roads around this area as usual and then uh, Maybe uh, hit up on a friend of ours who's uh, uh, recovering from some, uh, some minor uh, stuff. <laughs> so we will uh, try to see if we can uh, pay a quick visit to him there, one of our motorcycle buddies. So uh, that's what it's all about. Uh. So I'm going to uh, head on to uh, Salina and wait for the other guys to come on 455 uh, as usual. Uh, you know, I like to ride uh, on my own, <laughs> at my own pace, uh, but uh, let's see, so I will catch you guys in a bit. Uh, this is on uh, 1461 I'm going now, it's been, uh, I don't think I've uh, come on this road uh, before, at least not that I remember. So uh, let's see how it goes, it goes and hits uh, Preston Road, I've been on the other side of it. But not on this side. It's been a while since I took some uh, turns and stuff, so uh, let's see how I, if I remember all the all the tricks of the trade. Uh, good old uh, McKinney back roads here. I think long time ago I went on this road. This hits Custer, and then I used to take the Custer, uh, the 2478, I think, up north to hit uh, 455, but now I'm just going to go up to Salina. Just boring you with all these details for people who are not in this area, but uh, uh, good old uh, Texas farmland here in the back, which is uh, soon going to be uh, changed into subdivisions. <laughs> I remember that. That's 380 out there. A uh, beautiful uh, summer day. It's about 80 degrees. <laughs> I was just talking to a guy about uh, the importance of a mesh jacket in Texas. Uh, oh, 165. This will go to 455. Yeah, so in Texas, uh, you pretty much uh, have, you can manage with two jackets. One jacket, which is a textile jacket for all seasons except June and July and August <laughs> because that's the time you'll need uh, a jacket which can handle at least about 90 to 100 degrees and uh, if you're going on a short trip then a mesh jacket is, uh, is the perfect way to go. Uh, I was just telling my friends that uh, summertime I use the good old uh, things from India uh, the things which we used to do for extreme heat wear cotton clothes because cotton absorbs the moisture your sweat and then uh, lets it out slowly so you know your body kind of cools down nicely whereas if you put dry fit on a summer day it just wicks out the sweat and then the body doesn't have enough time to cool down and the sweat is just wasted and you keep losing water at a very high rate so that's what I do, wear cotton inside uh, my mesh jacket uh, for summers, but in the winter time, yeah, I like to get a dry fit because you don't want, you want the moisture to get away, otherwise you feel cold. <laughs> uh, 
uh, don't ask me how I know about it. <laughs> uh, there was one day in uh, Red River and it was extremely cold and we were uh, doing some serious off-roading, at least <laughs> because of my level. And uh, man, by the end of the uh, end of the day, whenever we stopped or you know, I was just freeze. Oh, that was a cat or something across the road. Anyway, this is 3478. From here on, I've been on this road, but uh, this is back to Prosper again. So uh, I will catch you guys in a bit again. Hello, guys. Yeah. Hey, what's up? What's up? Hello, Hello, sir. How are you? <laughs> hey. You guys are here at the brick. <laughs> at the famous Salina mural. Take the next right onto West Farm to Market 455 East Pecan Street, then turn left onto North Preston Road. Turn left onto North Preston Road. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Lindstambaugh Parkway. It's the usual route, uh, the 455. Uh, probably just take a little bit of it and then uh, pass on uh, recording Okay, now uh, we just ended the uh, 455 area, so probably just uh, do a quick stop here and head out there, unless people are just stopping there to do some stuff. Head southeast, then turn left. Right onto Farm to Market 455 East, West White Street. Okay, now uh, we are heading out to meet one of our friends. Um, so he, uh, he uh, had a minor stroke and, uh, you know, he's in the rehabilitation center. Continue and, uh, straight onto Farm to Market 455 East. A good West body of Street. us rides motorcycles with us. Uh, he's uh, one of the guys who uh, organizes all these rides. Continue and on Farm to Market so, uh, 455 East. It's a good thing to go miles. visit him uh, as part of this ride <laughs> because uh, he would have loved to be on this one and hopefully he should be here uh, on it pretty soon. <laughs> so, uh, yep. Other than that, uh, things are pretty good. It's getting uh, really hot out here. So if, you, if you're riding, it's fine. But if you stop, man, it gets a little hot. OK, 
Okay, uh, we are uh, getting close to where uh, Sajim is saying, staying. Uh, looks like a nice place out here. Take the, the next right are, uh, onto County Road 472. Getting nicer here in terms of this vegetation. In a quarter mile, keep left to stay on County Road 472. Keep left to stay on County Road 472, then turn right onto Miracle Lane. Take the next right onto Miracle Lane, then your destination will be on the right. In 800 feet, turn right to stay on Pate Way. Head south on Pate Way. In 600 feet, turn right to stay on Pate Way. Take the next left onto Pate Way, then turn left onto County Road 472. There he is. Hello, no, sir. No, don't let don't let him. Don't let him. Oh, okay. He'll lock out. <laughs> so sorry. Hello, sir. How are you? What are you doing? Fan, let's go. Let's leave this. Let's go. Bus. Fantastic. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Getting better. Yeah. Yep, better yep. Bike. You know, it's just a matter of Chal time, buddy. Hold it, hold it, hold both, uh, yeah, hold both the... Hold the hand. 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 Hold the Oh, okay. Nice, nice. Looks like a trimming edge. I got trimmed last week. Okay. Oh, it's got a shaving machine. We have a little bit. So, trim care is a little bit. Yeah, it's a little bit. Actually, they, uh, the guy did it free of cost. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, that was a good ride, guys. Uh, it was fun uh, meeting our friend again. Uh, so, uh, pretty soon they should be back uh, on the bike again. <laughs> so, uh, so that's what's been going on. Nothing, uh, nothing much. Uh, get back to riding off-road and uh, making some uh, some rides here around uh, DFW. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'll uh, talk to you guys later. Hang loose and uh, ride safe.